What's going on YouTube? PJ coming back with another video. But today, we're just gonna be talking about a few things and before you get on me, I already know. Dang PJ, what are you doing with your hair? I am actually about to go get my hair cut and I thought it would be a good idea for me to talk to you guys on the way there. Sorry how loud my car is, that's why I came way over here if you haven't noticed. I'm like a ways away from it, but if you like that exhaust, eh, I mean, it's it's not all that to me, but it, it does sound really good. So, um, I'm just gonna drive to go get my hair cut and talk to you guys on the way there about some things that I have going on and planning to do with the car. And, oh yeah, and I'm gonna announce the winner of the giveaway. If you haven't been in the giveaway, I'm sorry, but there are gonna be more giveaways on the channel. You could just stay tuned for that. But yeah, let me just go ahead and roll the intro. <laughs> First things first, put my seatbelt on. Cause y'all like to talk about me with my seatbelt off. All right, so before I start anything, let me go ahead and announce the winner of the giveaway. Drum roll, please. The winner of this, my first giveaway is Killer Vibe. Congratulations, Killer Vibe from, what is this? Charlotte, North Carolina. Congratulations to you. You've won the phone gimbal that I put on the video a couple of videos ago. And for a bonus, I'm actually gonna throw in two of these auto scents. Congratulations to you. They do smell kinda good, even though I can't smell them right now because it's still in the package. But congratulations, you'll be getting your package as soon as you email me back. I wanted to go ahead and do that before I pulled off because my car is kind of loud and I wanted to make sure that everybody heard who won the giveaway. So uh, congratulations once again. And for all of you who entered, I want to say thank you for everybody who entered the giveaway, who subscribed to the channel and the ones who are gonna stay on the channel because I'm very grateful for y'all. And without y'all, I couldn't even be doing any of this. So thank you. And I will be doing more giveaways on the channel. For those of you who want to win something, there will be more chances. Just letting you guys know. Alright, so the next thing on the list of things that I want to talk to you guys about is what should be my next mod for the car? Um, I was thinking maybe to go performance then again when I look at my car I'm like uh I could do something with the way it looks but uh I'm not gonna tell you guys what I think I'm gonna do next I want you guys to tell me what you think I should do next in the comment section below so uh please just do that for me and while we're on the list of talking about me purchasing things um there were also three things that I had on my mind that I really think I need to try to invest in next and uh, one of those things will happen to be tires. And the reason I don't classify this as a mod is because that's really something that I might need or will need in the near future. So um, I was thinking about just probably getting the same tires that are on here, the Pilot Super Sports, or going a little bit cheaper and getting something else, probably some uh, Nitto Antique Triple Nickels and uh, I don't know, something, I just needed to be a street tire since this is my daily and not a drag radio. Um, so uh, you can comment down in the section below for that also. And if I didn't get tires, then I would invest in another camera. I was looking at the Sony Alpha, just because one, like I said, like I said in a previous video, um, the Sony Alpha, it would give me an option for an external microphone. And as you can see, the audio quality of this camera while I'm driving my car isn't all that good. So I was gonna invest in another camera and I could also change the lens on that camera so I could do a little bit more photography and things like that. And last but not least, the other thing that's on my mind about buying would happen to be a drone. I'm pretty sure that the Maverick Pro 
why they said that's the go-to uh, drone. But um, I don't think I want to spend that much money on a drone right now. So the one that I'm looking for, the DJI Spark, um, that one, it actually is a bit smaller, but I think it would do just about everything that I would like it to do. And so that's why I think it would be the, the best learning drone for me and I could keep it for a long time. If you ever had the drone and had any problems with it, then you're probably not gonna like the fact that I'm gonna get it, but I do see good potential in the drone. So that's the last thing that I've been looking forward to getting. It was either the tires, the camera, or the drone. Because I mean, who doesn't love aerial shots? And then it also has a follow mode on it and I would use that greatly, especially with while I'm driving my car, I can get good rolling shots and just nice video while I'm not controlling it. It could be controlling itself. And I know, I know, I know you guys, the car events and just getting out and seeing more, a bigger variety of vehicles and meeting different people. I'm gonna need to start doing that like really soon, more often, because I feel like that's what you guys wanna see. That's what you guys like to see. And that's what I like to be around. I wanna be around more people like me with channels so I could possibly collab with them in the future and just get good, great all around content and help out their channel as well as them helping out mine and we can grow as one. I mean, that's what YouTube is all about. In my opinion, that's what YouTube is all about. And so that's really what I like to get into doing more often. I'm willing to be invited and fly out to you guys if you guys would wanna do that and wanna be featured on the channel. Just let me know, email me. I'll leave my email in the description box below. Or, you know what, I'll put it on the screen also. You can just email me at this email. And we could set something up for some time. The next big car event that I'm going to will probably be Scraping the Coast in Biloxi, Mississippi. That's uh, the beginning of June, I believe. So uh, I'm saving up for that. And I might enter in something down there and I plan on meeting some of you guys if you're gonna be there so just let me know if you're gonna be there Yeah, you think they should see them. 